So my name's Kirsty Chapman and I work for Castle Milk Youth Complex, um, which is based in the south side of Glasgow. Um, I teach, um, well I facilitate a community youth work skills class. So it's basically um, informal education with the, the two high schools in the community um, and it's part of their subject choices. So they pick my class as one of the classes. Um, and we do all things related to uh, youth work, community development, play, um, kind of issue-based work, things like that. But a big aspect of the class is the HIC course, which is Health Issues in the Community. And that's what kind of um, gives it its, its status almost, which is really, really good. So we cover lots of issues. And one of the groups um, in my group work project was saying that hygiene poverty is a massive thing just now and it's even more of an issue because lots of people have been furloughed because of covid then obviously in the run up to christmas we were asking uh, local organizations if they could instead of buying your colleague a wee daft like christmas hat or tin of biscuits for your boss or something like that instead spend that five or all that tenner whatever you would normally put in your secret santa towards um, toiletries for a young person and then it just grew and it's honestly the quickest and the craziest uh, time ever so it's grew from people buying sets to then them buying individual items to then from this bag that I gave out in class to now growing to a month's worth of toiletries which come in a massive bag like this and it's, it's so heavy <laughs> one of them says to me the other day was like how how is why <laughs> why are people being so kind and I was like well, why wouldn't they They're like I bet it's just a bunch of young people saying that we want to start something and I said well that's that's enough people believe in you and they they want to support you and your voice is being heard and that doesn't happen often for um young people in general but um, these young people this is potentially the first time where they've been heard um, and they've seen change so quickly.